Holder closing arguments will be delivered tomorrow, three years after 10 people were killed in a Boulder King Supers. Your reporter Kennedy Cook continues our coverage this morning from the Boulder County Courthouse. Yeah, Kennedy, the question jurors will have to answer is whether Ahmad Aliso was sane at the time of the shooting. You know, Brian, the topic of mental health has been a discussion throughout the entire duration of this trial. Was Alyssa sane during the time of the shooting? Did he show early signs of schizophrenia? And how do cultural differences impact mental health and the stigmas associated with getting help? These are all questions both sides have, have asked experts to take to the stand to help jurors better understand and ultimately make a decision. I sat in court yesterday where we heard from forensic psychologists and psychiatrists as well as family members of the gunman who shot and killed 10 people at a table Mesa King Superstore in 2021. The gunman's younger brother, Mahmoud Alyssa, took the stand, sharing that his brother was, quote, very antisocial, and that on the day of the shooting, his brother couldn't decipher right from wrong. We heard from a psychologist who evaluated Ahmad Alyssa, who described him looking, quote, vacant, unemotional, and expressionless. A blind expert in cultural psychology took the stand to discuss how Middle Eastern culture differs from American, specifically surrounding mental health and the stigmas that come with. Now, the judge did give jurors the day off while the court decides on jury instructions. We are expecting those closing statements to start tomorrow with deliberations possibly happening as early as tomorrow afternoon. Live in Boulder, I'm your reporter, Kennedy Cook, covering Colorado First. Kennedy, thank you. Let's get to Joel Hill.